man just came out of jail. I just want to throw that out there. That man just came out of jail. Yeah, yeah. See all, 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 all that movement. He just came out of jail. He going back in. He going back in. That's crazy. Who sent me this? You know what? At least he came out how he was probably was up in there. Pause. Because it's a lot, it's a lot of dudes, man. It's a lot of dudes that be gay for the stay. It's a lot of dudes that be gay for the stay, man. They get locked up going there, you know, getting their all changed. You feel what I'm saying? A lot of dudes go to jail, get their all changed, and, and come out and, and and be talking gangster. Be 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 be. All right. Let me let me just stop. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, she said no. She said no. Bruh. That's messed up. I saw this video, but the title was basically like, um, the dude is an older gentleman. He bought her a car. And, you know, he created this whole beautiful romantic day. And he proposed to her and she pretty much said no. You feel me? And, again, I don't know what country that is. That's one of them Hispanic countries. And homie seemed like, though, he got that bread. He got that money. And it just seems as though she was using his ass. She was using his ass. Let me tell y'all, high-valued man something, man. Um, Stop dating women that's only dating y'all for y'all money. Find somebody who really, you can really vibes with. That way, when you fully commit, you're not going to have a situation like this. That's embarrassing. Do you know how embarrassing it is to propose to somebody and they say no? I ain't going to lie, though. She thick. I, You know. I would have folded too. She thick than a motherfucker, dog. I recently was going on dates with a man. And? And nice guy, good guy. Treated me well. That is good! But. Damn, they said, but, they said, but, why did you stay out all this? And but. <laughs> but once I realized that he was not my husband, because I'm only looking for husband energy at the moment, I ended things with him. Jesus Christ, what about the back? This, this, being a good and nice man is not enough anymore. You have to be Duracell battery too and bring energy. <laughs> told him that I didn't see it going any further. Lady, you are hungry. The Lord served you with a good, well-cooked chicken. And you decided <laughs> not to eat it because of the chicken's energy. You will starve. He agreed. He said that he didn't think that he could make me happy. And while I appreciate that, it was a very kind response. He didn't even try. For what? You didn't what? Him to respect your wishes or what? He didn't even try. He didn't even try and say that he like wanted to change, that he wanted to like whatever. Like, I can be manipulated. I will listen to you. <laughs> but you didn't even try. Mother of Lord, she wanted the man to manipulate her. What type of twisted mind games is that? She thinks dating is PlayStation 5. Yes, <laughs> Hey, bruh. And leave this good man alone. I recently was... Bruh. Hey. Listen, man. Hey. We got... Listen. I got women that are subscribed to this channel. I just be wanting to know how y'all be feeling about some of these videos, dog. To be quite honest with you, some of these videos I watch, I be like, man, this shit is so far-fetched. This shit is crazy. I can't believe there's people like, out there like that. Sometimes I be thinking motherfuckers be acting, bro. But... I'm a t similar story. We have a family friend, female, beautiful lady, beautiful. Um, she grew up with my wife, okay? And she, this weekend, a situation happened with one of her longtime uh, friends. And I, friends, you feel what I'm saying? They got into a little back and forth because this man has been in love with her for almost 15 years. They have never done the nasty. He has been pushing. 
pushing. When I say pushing, he has been pushing to get with her. Just go out his way and shit like that. So they went on a little date and they got in a conversation and he was like, when the, when was the last time you had sex? And she was like, last year. He lost it. He lost it. And she on the phone with us and she like, yo, I don't understand, like, you know, why he did it. I'm like, bruh, you violated this man. This man has been in love with you for the past how much years. He's been doing all these things for you. And, like, you gave the box to somebody who don't deserve it. And granted, bro, she not no, y'all not finna come on here and say she a hoe or nothing. She not no hoe, bro. The way she have sex is like Jeepers Creepers, bro. You know the show when you come out once every couple years? Like, that's literally how she moved, bro. I say all that to say, bro. She was saying all this shit, I don't understand, da 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 So we was like, well, you know, just leave him alone if he gonna stay da da And then she burst out and said, but I love him. I said, what? She's like, yeah, I, I love him. What you, what? What you mean? And she got into the whole spill about, you know, he, he a hood. So it's kind of like, he need to put the best foot forward for things to change. And I'm like, but does he really know that? Women have so much power to change the outlook on a man's life that I don't think some women understand how much power they have or they just use it for the wrong things. I know how strong some of you niggas are about not following what your woman say or just being a man and da 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 da. But yo, behind every strong man is a good woman, bro. As men, we supposed to think logically, but sometimes our logic be off, bro, and you just need the right woman to push you back on the right track. At the same time, the wrong woman could fucking derail the fuck out of you. The, the right one could be, is she like a bodyguard for all your your your, your testosterone-filled bullshit? Because trust me, it's a lot of situations that I even wouldn't have been here or I'd be locked up or something. A man's worst enemy is, is his pride, bro. And sometimes it takes a woman to, to get you to start thinking logically and not with your pride. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the video for today. Um, yeah, I need y'all to start uh, following me on Instagram. I need I need more y'all to follow me on Instagram, man. My Instagram is lacking. My Instagram following is not. Uh, it doesn't reflect, you know, the family that I have on YouTube, and that's that's not that's a no bueno. That's a no bueno, man. I would like to have a, a little bit more personal relationship with some of you guys because a lot of y'all be in the comment section, y'all be talking to me. Some of y'all be sending me messages on Instagram and don't follow me, which just doesn't make any sense. So go ahead, follow me on the gram. I'm going to leave a link. Follow me on the gram.